pleased with the performance from the team. I thought uh, mentally we were really switched on. Um, Rovigo, you know, gave us a, a really good stiff fight, and they didn't they didn't drop off even in the last ten minutes. Their back rollers were running around, uh, belting people in the tackle. So, from my point of view, I was just very um, pleased with the fact that um, we didn't let up mentally. We we stayed on them, and we grafted and we grinded for the full eighty minutes. So, from that point of view, it was a a good performance and. You know, for guys like Miles Dorian to kick 10 out of 10 and Topsy to get a hat-trick and all those individual performance things, that was terrific. But I think the collective group mentality was what pleased me most. The net effect from the big performance yesterday means there's a, a lot of a lot more competition for spots. Um, so the, you know, the, the so-called backup players have really put a marker down and um, it's given me selection headaches for probably the first time this season really. Um, because once we got into that first role of that first block of games, we were going quite well and there was no real need to, to tinker too much. But now we've, we've had a fresh look at some players. Um, a number of those boys put their hands up and um, obviously you know, we've, we've got an opportunity to reward them on Friday night in Grenoble. Yeah, Grenoble are a very good team. Um, uh, we had a, a little bit of a look at them in the pre-season uh, when we were over there. Um, when we played Montpellier, they played uh, Harlequins. Um, so we, we, we understand the, the, the terrain, so to speak. Uh, we've got a lot of respect for what they've done so far. They're in the top six, in the, in the top 14. So you don't get there by mistake. Uh, they've taken a lot of big scalps, and as you say, they're unbeaten at home. So it'll be a big challenge for us. But um, if we're to do anything in this competition, um, we're going to need to win, um, and we're going to need to win on the road. Um, and that's, uh, you know, that's crucial for us to, to take the next step forward.